everyone. I'm getting ready to visit this really cute cafe with my friend today. And I am, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm so low energy today. I can't wait to go out, eat tons of bread, and do some window shopping with her. I feel like girl dates are like the best. It really does just recharge you in some way. But yeah, quick thoughts on dating before I head out. If you're not secure in yourself, you end up going on this like emotional roller coaster every time a situationship or like, a date doesn't go well. And it can be super unhealthy, but also very eye opening because you start learning like all the things that you were insecure about and start working on those things. I've learned a lot about what I like and what I don't like and a lot about myself, a lot about my own insecurities and like what I want to start working on now. It's been very, very eye-opening. If you're ready to be vulnerable and be open to these experiences, highly recommend but also don't recommend if you're not ready, especially in New York City. so pretty Okay, so I'm doing something tonight that's making me a little nervous. Um, I booked a jazz show for myself to go by myself. Um, and I've never done this before, but it's just like, um, it's a space that I really, really like. I went there like twice. I think I went there twice and I loved it so much. Um, but I didn't, like I wanted to go again, but I didn't really want to depend on anybody else to like get that opportunity so I booked a ticket for like tonight but now I'm like chickening out because it's such an intimate space like you're literally shoulder to shoulder with other people and most of the time it's like people are in groups with like friends or like they're a couple I don't know if I saw like people alone going there but ah uh... Why am I so nervous? Like I'm literally like sweating nervous. I don't know why <laughs> and I'm sure it'll be like completely fine, but um, I don't know. I can't help but feel a little like self-conscious like doing these like things alone in such an intimate space. I think it's fine if it's like a big space, but when it comes to spaces where there are a lot of couples or people who usually go with friends, I do think I get a little like self-conscious slash like nervous so yeah but hopefully the music is so good that I don't even think about any of that um <laughs> I think it'll be good I think this year is a year that I just push myself to do things that make me uncomfortable and I think this is a great like stepping stone towards that okay yeah fit check it is freezing out today so i wore some leggings this puffer and a skirt i've been really into like long skirts lately oh my god why am i so scared i don't know 
Okay, I'm sure, I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. Nobody's gonna care. <laughs> I am sure it will be fine. <laughs> or something and I heard this and I was like wow that is a song I would like to sing one day and I didn't know when that day was gonna be That was like so much fun, but they literally sat me like a feet away from the front stage Which is like the opposite of exactly what I wanted I wanted to sit in like the corner where I could hide and like be by myself But I was literally a foot away from the singer and I don't know It was still like a really good experience and it was a lot of fun and I think I might go back sometime too getting ready to go to the new Gucci museum um they have like a free pass like every month and I I signed up for one I got a spot from like three to five today so I am heading there soon I just gotta get ready because I am running late um I don't know what to wear though I'm gonna go for something like cozy and comfy today. Also, this perfume smells so good. Um, it's like if you're into like more subtle scents, I think this is really good. It's called Dead Cool Layering Fragrance in Milk. It does not last that long though, and it is kind of oily, but it smells really good. Okay, let's go. Yeah. 